Morning everyone. How do you like my hair? My favourite little bit is this bit at the back. How cute is my little rat's tail? <laughs> so I've not done my makeup yet. Obviously, I feel like I'm like really close. Obviously, I've not done my makeup yet today, but um, I decided after doing my makeup yesterday, I realised I'd been using the same products way too much. So um, I'm going to be doing my makeup today, but I'm just going to be doing it with some different bits. So I thought I would include this, but not make such a big thing out of it. Also, yeah, I don't know what's happened with my nails, but I'm going to get them done tonight instead of Monday. So yeah, I'm going to do my makeup and then what I need to do is clean out my wardrobe. I'm going to do a big clear out. I'm going to upload loads of stuff to Depop as well. So as you would have seen, I did some shopping last night and I bought some new stuff. So yeah, that's basically what today is. Makeup, clear out. I do have to shoot a blog post, but that's just like a beauty one. And then um, nails. So that's basically my day. I look like I've got a really bad toupee. <laughs> I literally look like I've got the worst toupee. I'm Donald Trump. Amazing. <laughs> the foundation that I told you about on Snapchat yesterday is the By Terry Eclat Opulent and um, this is the shade 100 in Warm Radiance. Now this foundation is supposed to match skin type so like they put the lightest one on me and it matched my fake tan it was insane but this is the darkest one I believe and um it's insane like the coolest foundation ever and it, it's not as expensive as my La Prairie foundation which is like 200 pounds or something like that but it is an expensive foundation but it lasts so long so I'm gonna whack this on my face you're gonna see how like little you need of this um where's my little spatula so I'm just using the lid at the moment because you honestly need the tiniest bit and I just like dab it on and then swipe it down my face. See that is totally not the colour for my skin but you will see what happens. Um, it does take like a little bit of time to match your skin so like at the moment I don't think that this is matching my skin at all um, and it was funny on snapchat when I showed you it was like not matching and then by the end of it it was matching because it just like takes time to like oxidize and um, mimic your skin color basically oh I have to choose a different bronzer I went straight for my Chanel one let's try a different one let's go for Tom Ford shall we what is I swear my hair's getting worse Let's sort this out. <laughs> this is like the biggest brush ever, so I'm worried that this is gonna to be too big for this, but there we go. Need to really work this, wow. I feel like I'm having like a workout with my bronzer. <laughs> At least it's actually light now. Oh my gosh, it's been so dark today. Okay, this is looking better. Let's bronze the neck. You can stay at my eyebrows. What is that? <laughs> I like the colour of it, but I feel like, wow, like that took a lot of work. Um, maybe I'm using like the wrong brush or something, but that felt like I was not getting a lot of product off of that. Um, you don't want your bronzer to be effort. Let's go with the Elizabeth Arden Natural Eyebrow Pencil. This I'm guessing is just like the HD brow ones that I use, so might be a little bit easier to get hold of. So this feels a little bit softer than the um, HD one and a little bit warmer in colour as well. The HD one's quite ashy, which is good for my colouring. For my powder, I'm going to use the Le Mer powder because literally I've been so excited to use this. So, oh, I'm going to take this thing. Oh my God. Oh, okay. <laughs> the pancake brush. And um, I'm just going to, I'm going to shake it. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to use the pancake brush and just dust this over Ooh. oh I mean I can't ever see a Lemur powder or product disappointing but Ooh. oh I love trying new stuff why don't I do this more often I'm such a creature of habit I need to stop let's go with the um Marc Jacobs air blush nice but it's not Milani Milani has this like iridescent oh it does a little bit actually I spoke too soon I spoke too soon lovely um Highlight, highlight. I am not allowed to use the By Terry Sun Designer palette, so what shall I use? Let's just try the Rodeal because I love their contour. I really like this mascara. I've used it before, so this is cheating, but I do really like this mascara. This is one of the best high-end mascaras. 
definitely. Ooh. I always miss the like tubey thing when I, uh, I pull the ugliest face when I do like things around my eyes. I'm like, <laughs> uh. which is another thing um, to discuss, I guess, after we discussed my fillers. Um, I find that there's a lot of people that are like, um, Lydia looks so different from different angles. Well, like, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna look weird if I'm like this. Just like any, of course I'm gonna look weird. My face is multi-dimensional. There, there will be um, different aspects to it that um, you won't maybe have seen before. And that's okay. And I, I, might, I may well be ugly from, from other angles, but that's okay too. But yeah, it's just something to bear in mind that we all look different from different angles. And sometimes we're caught off guard and sometimes we're just uglier. Sometimes we're just having a bad day. But um, yeah, be nice people, be nice. You don't have to talk about how everyone looks all of the time. Like there's so much more to life than how people look and it's, it's such a silly thing to to base anything on like i i really i really care a lot less about how people look nowadays and more about the person that they are and um it's always like frowned upon for you to stand there and say oh you know i'm such a good looking person but one thing i'm not afraid to say is that i'm a good person i know that for sure i'm a good person and i will shout that from the rooftops and you can say anything you want about how i look I don't care, as long as I'm a good person. So whether you think I look ugly from this angle, <laughs> oh, I'm just rambling. Love this mascara though. My gosh, I'm getting all of the phone calls this morning. Hey. Uh, hey. How are you? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, I'm good, thank you. Can you talk? I, I can, hold on, let me just turn my camera off, hold on. So I've not contoured today and I've gone for quite a sort of like neutral lip, although it's not lasting that well. Um, I've just eaten toast. So this is my first time using the Charlotte Tilbury Lip Cheat. Um, and this is in Pillow Talk. And everyone always said that they couldn't believe I'd never tried this, so I am doing it. But yeah, so I've not bothered to like contour my nose at all today because I'm just going for like quite natural makeup. Um, but this mascara, can we just talk about this? This is amazing. Oh, that's the door. Let's go get it. I'm still in my dressing gown. This is really embarrassing. Oh, yeah. oh crumbs. Oh, wow. Thank you. Is it just the one? Yeah. Huh. Well, I might put more in there. I don't know what's in there. Okay. No worries. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, bye. bye. Oh. <laughs> Look what just arrived. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. This one matches my um, large suitcase that um, I have from Toomey and it's personalized. Like, oh my God, look at my nails. I'm so glad I'm going to get them done tonight. Um, so this is for like shorter trips and for carry on luggage and I'm just obsessed. Honestly, once you spend a little bit more on a suitcase, you understand why people do it because it's like they're floating on a cloud. I just, I literally love these suitcases. They're so nice. So this is my look today basically. I haven't done anything to my hair. Literally I just sleep with my hair like um, in a knot on the top of my head and it just kind of comes out the same. It doesn't kink or anything which is really good. It makes it so much easier. Um, but yeah, I've just really gone for like minimal makeup today because I can't be bothered and I'm just, I've whacked on this jumper because honestly these are the snuggliest jumpers ever. Like they look great so I can wear them out and about but they also, like they're also super comfortable. Today I'm actually sorting out my wardrobe again because it's a mess again, but I'm actually sorting it out to start selling stuff. I am gonna be selling some items on my Depop, which I will pop on screen for you. If you want to come and find me on Depop, I'm there. And um, I'm hoping to sell like quite nice stuff, to be honest, um, because I've just got so much stuff that I don't need. And um, I'm a bit of a hoarder. If Basically what no one will know about me is when I was younger, I, um, I remember I had a friend come round to my house and um, she, I remember she looked in my wardrobe and she was like, where's all your stuff? Like, where is all of your clothes? And um, I didn't have any. But I'm not saying that like, you know, I don't really know why I didn't have clothes. I just didn't. I remember I had like one tracksuit and like a couple of jumpers and I just didn't have loads of stuff because I don't think I was interested in that yet. And I remember how I felt and I was like, oh my goodness, like I've got no clothes. 
and I think that that's where the obsession began but I'm really good and I don't hoard as much as I used to I do have to be brutal because of the volume of clothes that like pass through because I'm obviously constantly taking outfits and stuff like that but I try and be realistic with it but yeah so I thought that we could have a bit of a clear out together and I could uh explain to you what I'm getting rid of and why I'm getting rid of it and then you can I guess go and shop it on Depop if you want <laughs> um I can even try some stuff on for you if you'd like <laughs> but yeah so I guess let's get cracking because um there's a lot to get through I'm about to show you oh god I honestly have no idea how this happens I wish I did I wish I was able to explain why this happens to my wardrobe but this is literally like twice a week that it gets like this and then I have to tidy up but I think it's because there's just not enough space in there so I just shove stuff in quickly because I don't have the time to like um, sort it out so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to sort everything out and then I'm also going to clear stuff out because I know that that bag down there everything in there and the bag itself the Celine bag itself has got to go so yeah let's get brutal so first things first I need to get all of this stuff out of my wardrobe so coats accessories things to shoot oh my god I can't wait to shoot this coat it's so snuggly blazers dresses look at this jumper how Chloe-esque is that it's from Abercrombie oh my god it's beautiful absolutely beautiful new bag that you're not allowed to see luckily I've taken it out the wrong way so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take this this out here Just wearing a slight variation of the other day's outfit it is this jumper in the wine kind of color which I literally ummed and ahmed about for so long I could not decide whether I should get both but I'm really glad that I did because now I can wear the same outfit but in different colorways <laughs> but I better get in the car because I'm going to get my nails done I can't believe it I've lost like an entire nail well not a nail but an entire like gel but maybe we can do something a little bit more festive so Let's get going. up having my nails done and I can't believe that I actually went for a sort of festive color it looks really dark but it's not it's like kind of the color of my jumper but then it's got a little bit of like sparkle in it and it's so festive and I love it and I just I was actually really excited when they showed me it I was like I want that one so it's a nice change oh I'm so happy oh yay <laughs> um I've just, I'm going to go and check in HomeSense. I'm going to go and have a look in HomeSense because um, I want to try and find um, a rug for the house and they always have such nice Christmas stuff and I'm just not over um, getting Christmas decorations just yet. So I'm going to go see what they've got just because I, I'm just round the corner basically. I'm just going to pop in because I'm just round the corner and I'm feeling spontaneous. <laughs> God, win I found my dream makeup storage I can get rid of the hideous like acrylic stuff now that just does not suit my house at all and um, I've got my nice shiny one I'm so happy so happy um, didn't find any Christmassy stuff though I did find a sofa that I want but Ali won't let me get it until we've got a new house so oh it was so beautiful literally like the most beautiful sofa you've ever seen so I've just got home <laughs> And Ali is here, right? Let's just have a look at what Ali is doing right now. 
This is a chocolate salami. I cannot believe. Do, do what, just show them what you were just doing. <laughs> Go on, over the sink. <laughs> you can see the teeth. Have you noticed? <laughs> have you noticed that Ali likes to use the sink as his plate? <laughs> That's disgusting. Mm. Why don't you just top a bit off? It's all mine. That's true. It is all yours. You're an animal. All chocolate. <laughs> I had one big block of You're an animal. So I'm back home. I'm now making myself some cheesy chips. So excited. Cheesy chips and chicken nuggets, except not real chicken nuggets. They're um, vegetarian chicken nuggets. Oh, I'm so hungry. I feel like I haven't eaten all day. It's just, oh. So I'm uploading um, Vlogmas for today and and while that is uploading, I am going to organise because I always spend my life organising apparently, um, getting rid of those because I don't love them and putting them in here. So much room in there, oh my gosh, four like drawers. <gasps> I can actually use these still as well. I can put these in. Do they fit? Oh my god, they fit perfectly. I love this. Amazing. Look at that organization. I've got my click sticks. These are liquid lipsticks. These are matte liquid lipsticks. And these are lip liners and lip crayons. So I've taken all of my um, fragrances off of the top of there, some of them are on here and I'm going to feed them into here, um, which is kind of like my fragrance straw which lives up there. Then I've organised all of my fake tans, so I've got Coco Brown, um, Saint Tropez, Vita Liberata, James Reed, there was some Bondi Sands, but I think I've used that all up and I'm trying out these ones now. Um, yeah. So that's me finished off organising for the evening. Um, Ali's gone to bed, so I'm going to keep it short and sweet. But I'm so happy with my new makeup storage. So happy. <laughs> Hopefully tomorrow's going to be a little bit more fun than me just getting my nails done and organising my makeup. I swear I spend my life organising. But it's time to wash my face and go to bed. So I'll see you tomorrow.